hey guys welcome back to my channel and welcome to another vlog today i came to town specifically to take care of myself <laughs> so you guys for the past weeks two three weeks i've just not been feeling like myself i've just been going through a lot of emotions feeling like i am doing this motherhood thing this life thing on my own and i've just been feeling really overwhelmed i was talking with my husband the other day like you know what i don't want to be here alone anymore i don't want to be raising these kids on my own anymore i need you here i need you to play your role as the father because most of the time i feel like i am being the mom i'm being the dad and it can get quite exhausting you guys i definitely know how it feels like to be a single mom now and to be a single mom without the support of your husband i can just imagine what that would mean for the mom at least i know financially my husband is there i also know that like emotionally is there we're always on calls we're always talking is always talking to the kids but some days it's just like you know what i don't want to do this on my own i feel lonely sometimes and yeah it's just been overwhelming there's just been this overwhelming feeling of loneliness of aloneness when it comes to being here with the kids so yeah i've just been going through that and i've just realized i haven't taken care of myself in a while the holiday was exhausting like i said in my last vlog yes i'm not going to you know pretend like i was exhausted i literally felt exhausted at the end of the holiday and after that it was back to school we're in the groove chikoro, chikoro, chikoro. and now yeah everything just came together and i still remember after that sunday vlog i posted the following day on monday i literally could not get out of bed you guys i spent the whole day in bed just thinking about my life and i was just like maybe i need a day to myself so today is that day i'm literally here to take care of myself so i'm going to do my hair i haven't done my nails in a long long time so i really want to get my nails done you know both my fingers and my toes and go for some window shopping go for a lunch date coffee or something just aloneness a solid date <laughs> because i really feel like i need it you guys motherhood nobody prepares you for it nobody prepares you for it and Ethan has also not been feeling well for some time now. He is teething. And the past few days they have been horror. Like diaper explosions, crying, clinginess. It's just been a lot. So I really, really need this day to myself. So today is going to be that. I'm going to get my hair done first. And then after that, I'm going to grab lunch probably because I left home without eating anything. And then uh, I'm going to get, get my nails done, do a little bit of window shopping. And yeah, just pick out a few things that I need. But I just want to concentrate on myself today so that's what we are doing i hope you guys enjoyed the vlog let me know how it is for you if you're in my kind of situation where you're in a long distance marriage do you also get the feelings that i'm getting right now those feelings of loneliness of just feeling alone let me know in the comment section you guys let's share what you do to keep you know yourself motivated to continue doing this motherhood thing so yeah you guys let me not make this intro too long let's get going you made this work i made this worse we felt apart a thousand times a thousand times you moved away i'm here to stay i wish i could go back in time back in time I'm so sorry that I hurt you so deep Swear I spent the last few years just trying to change I'm on my knees and I'm begging you please Is there any chance you're thinking about me? If I change my
the last few years just trying to change Just getting into the car you guys I haven't had anything to eat since morning can you guys believe it I thought getting my hair done and my nose done was just going to take me a few hours but it has taken me literally the whole day and right now it's time for the school run but a girl's gotta eat so I went by that new food truck that I showed you guys I just saw it a few days ago and I was like you know what I should try this they are young guys they are really trying, they are really trying, so yeah. I just wanted to go there and check them out. And so I got myself some food, they are running a Mother's Day special. So I got the grilled steak, cheese, cheese, what, what, cheese steak, whatever. <laughs> so I got the grilled beef cheese steak, I think so, and chips for four dollars. And you guys, I'm dying of hunger. I'm not about to eat like a lady right now. I'm about to demolish this food. Did I show you guys my nails? So this is what the nails look like. Yeah. They look so cute. I think they're cute. I haven't had nails in about a year, you guys. In more than a year. So it just feels good. To have my nails done I also did my toes and I also did my hair I'm feeling so much better you guys I feel so much better already so let's taste this grilled cheese steak what what and see if I like it so this is what it looks like you guys I don't know if you will be able to see. Let me open it like this. So this is what it looks like. Let's hope their bun is soft. Because one thing I don't like. Timba. Sakaoma. Mm, mm, mm. It's really good, you guys. Even though Chinguachacho is a bit dry, but the meat, there's bacon, there's beef, there's onions, pepper, there's a sauce that they put in here, which is really good. It's really nice. <laughs> I 
hey guys so i'm done with my cheesesteak it was really nice you guys it was really nice i enjoyed it and i'll definitely be going back again <coughs> to buy again i was just happy to try out something different the one thing i don't like about staying in chino is that akuna ma restaurants akawanda yukuenda kunojika like really proper food i look at my vloggers aruku harare you know, showing us my restaurants around Harare, especially Sharon. Sharon, <laughs> you've made me hate my town for not having them restaurants like you have in Harare. <laughs> if you don't know who I'm talking about, Sharon Mungazi, I'm going to put a channel name on the screen. If you are living in Harare and you want to see the cool spots, I could just say, you way to go, check out a channel. Anyway. I was saying, unlike Harare, Munum Chinoi, we don't have those restaurants. It's either okay now chicken in Kana Trukenda eat and league. Or you're going to these other small, small restaurants and go bigger than any rice. And that's it. So you don't really get like a variety of food. Chinese, Italian, like there is nothing like that. It's either chicken in eat and league or other uh or these other restaurants. So it was really nice it was really nice to see people who are trying to do something different something unique and these are young guys you guys it just inspired me to see young guys trying to do something different uh for themselves trying to make some money for themselves so yeah i really enjoyed that cheesesteak and they definitely have a new customer in me i won't be going to notenga mabega akaoma so we don't want to say names but it's better i spend that same amount to the food truck and i've never really seen a food truck anywhere around chinoi so it was just great to see something different you guys it was just good to see something different can you see how i'm talking with my nails no that's my nails like i can't like uh, 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 what? 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 <laughs> you guys, I do Let me find a bin and throw this away. Otherwise, it will be a story. Why? 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 Why must not take it Why? They didn't know what it They don't know what today was my day. It was just about me. I was selfish today. I decided to be selfish. I have enjoyed my day now. I'm going back to the mom life. You guys can already feel the energy difference. And <laughs> you guys, let me go. I will see you guys later. Bye bye. Eventually. Hey guys, so I am now at home. Um, back to motherhood duties. <laughs> so I'm about to get started on dinner. You guys, Nasan Kobra Maxin and didn't even think about what I'm going to have for dinner. Which I don't like. Very disorganized. But anyway, lucky for me, I cooked a lot of goat meat the day before the day before yesterday. I just bought the meat and I put it in the fridge. So I'm just going to do a quick meal rice, uh fried goat meat and maybe a coleslaw salad something very simple and straightforward so that's what we're going to do right now ah uh, no uh -uh. come inside guys it's cold out here yeah. what is it yeah. what's the say hi yeah. say hi what's that what's inside there what's inside what's inside there kiss mama this is going down the school car to Nuka Mana. Say hi! Yay! So, you guys, I didn't tell you this, but Ethan has been teething, and the diaper explosions have been real, you guys. The diaper explosions, he's been fussy, he's been clingy. He was. No, 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 and yeah, I, I, it's just been a lot, but today was feeling much better. We want to make noise with the bottle. 
Oh oh. Pick it up. Mm. Uh, you don't want to pick it up. Pick it up. Get down and pick it up. But you don't want to pick it up. What's there? There's nothing there. This is an empty bottle. And another update, you guys. I can't even say. But I shouldn't have look at fun fun. So I cut it off. Hopefully, he'll get better hair. Hey, hey. No. No. <laughs> so even there's the forehead gang. <laughs> Okay, you guys, let me get started on dinner. Sunshine, I've been waiting. Sunshine, why are you playing? With my head all the time, you go way out of line. Sunshine, don't keep me. So don't let me down I chase away your shadows Away from the crowd I give you my tomorrow Forever now Spotlight from my cell phone Sounds like it's your ringtone I get chills when you call Wanna give Can't you love me instead? 